Centrifugal forces. Okay, well, what's a centrifugal force? That sounds a lot like a centrifuge, right? Well, that's that thing that you put some material in in a test tube, you spin it around, and the really dense stuff goes to the bottom, and it's that force that's pulling it to the bottom, right, away from the rotation. That's pretty much what a centrifugal force is, right? We've got a centripetal force, remember, which pulls towards the center of a rotation, okay? And so the centrifugal force, it would seem, is pushing away, right? Newton's third law says that every force has an equal and opposite force. So centripetal force, centrifugal force, right? The only problem is it's not a real force. And this is physics. We can't have fake forces, right? That's, that's silly, all right? Well, why is it not a real force, okay? Well, let's look at it, okay? So we have in a object that's rotating around a center, we have a couple forces that are acting on the object, right? We've got Remember, at any point along here, we have a force called inertia. And inertia is always going to be moving the object tangentially or at a right angle from the line to the center, okay, to the radius, okay? So that force, wherever we are on here, is going to be perpendicular to the center. So we've got these two forces, and they're acting. If, if we put them together and we say, this force is going this way, and our centripetal force is going this way, okay, they add up, right? We can add up these force vectors and we get the feeling that there is a force pushing in the opposite direction, right? But it's really the force of inertia that's pushing the object away from the center, which feels like it's going this direction, but really it's continuing to go away from it, right? Because if we release this object at any point, it would move in a tangent. It wouldn't just fly straight away from the center. So we know that that's the force, the force of inertia, that's making us think that there is this centrifugal force, which is just really a feeling, but it's not a real force. And that's, that's the truth behind this centrifugal force.